a people without a history, a people who do not know their history are totally lost. In Ghana, Founders Day is celebrated on the 4th of August and we at Open Foundation West Africa in partnership with the Ministry of Information see this as a levering opportunity to educate and encourage the creation of content that depicts traits of our country and people on Wikipedia, hence making information about our history, our culture and our people easily accessible by all through Wikipedia and its sister projects. Here are what some personalities have to say about Founders Day. Founders Day is a very significant moment in our calendar. It's um, a day that has to be celebrated. A day to commemorate the efforts of our forebears. The big six. I mean, you could mention all the names, the Obeche Bilamtes, the Dankwas, the Furiatas, the Kufuado. Who were part of the making and the creation of that particular country and its governing body. For me, Founders Day is an integral part of every country's culture and history. And I think it's very important that we don't see Founders Day as a day just to celebrate the people that liberated this country, but then a day to continue in the work that they started. On the 4th of August, has been instituted to celebrate them. For us in Ghana, it's a very significant time for us as well because um, it puts all the emphasis and the attention and the um, reminder on the persons who engineered the making of this country that we are also proud of, regardless of our challenges. Our stories are not being told and told well. Our younger ones are not being told the stories of our forefathers. So for me, Founders Day is something that will draw our younger generation's mind to what the day stands for. If they had not done what they did, today we would not have our freedom. And freedom means a lot to everybody. Well, it's, it's important to celebrate them because of their efforts. I mean, it's, uh, they, they toiled, their blood, and sweat, and they fought for our freedom. I mean, where we are today, we wouldn't have been liberated if not for their energies and, and their, their truth and the strength and, and what they wanted us to be free of, the struggle. How we gained independence, how far back it goes, where the struggle started. And for them to put their lives on for all of us for today, I think that they ought to be heavily celebrated. Um, I specifically choose music as um, you know some of the um, the foundations that uh, you know played a very significant role in um, in Ghana as we see it today as part of the support and the mechanisms that our founding fathers used just to be able to even communicate a better Ghana agenda for us. Um, one of such sorts is uh, you know a song from is it E.T. Mensa if I do recall, Ghana, the land of freedom. It's a song like this that you know speak on grounds of patriotism and um, we hear these songs and it's it just a clear reminder of where we came from and exactly where we are headed to. My father happened to be one of the police officers who stood at the polo grounds to take notes when Osajifo Dr. Kwame Nkrumah was talking and he told me about how the market women actually hustled the policemen, took their pens and the papers from them because the <clears throat> colonial masters had told the police officers to go and um, observe and report whatever happens there. What do you have to offer? What do you think can be um, what, the, what, what, what we can live up to when our fathers, you know, what our fathers created, what they have left for us? What can we do? Where can we take it from there? So the posterity asked us, and then we said, we also did something. As patriotic citizens, we play our own songs on radio, show our music videos on television, sing, our, sing in our own language. I wish I would be speaking my own language. Unfortunately, uh, other citizens are also watching, uh, other foreigners and people in the diaspora may also be watching. And so, uh, in a way, this is uh, another route to get to them. 
what are you also doing to set the pace? What are you also doing to, to leave a legacy? You may ask, how can you participate in this campaign? You can do that by contributing to content about our history and activities that led to Ghana's independence on Wikipedia and its sister project. Or you can share the campaign video within your network. For more information, visit our website or our social media accounts and keep yourself updated. Let's all come together to produce the right narrative about Ghana's history. Ghana, we now have freedom. freedom.